The winds were so intense, they took down this tree and with it, it brought down this power pole here. 90% of Halifax was without power after this storm rolled through. National Grid had said they would be restoring power this morning. They've had to push that time back because of all the damage throughout town. People who live here describe a quick burst of wind. For probably like 20 seconds, it just it looked like chaos. Trees uprooted, power lines pulled down. I think the top of these two trees that are intertwined broke off and they're now kind of landed on my back roof. Jana Heidenreich checked out the damage by her Lake Street home in Halifax this morning. We have a big pine tree that just snapped in half. And like her neighbors, she's wondering what exactly rolled through here. Yeah, and then there was like no wind at one point. I'm just like, this is crazy. It went from one extreme to another. It was crazy. There was just wind and a lot of thunder, a lot of rain, torrential rain pouring down. A tree came down across one lane of Route 58. Another blocked the entrance to the commuter rail station in Halifax, closing the parking lot this morning. Perhaps most dangerous large branches dangling in treetops. National grid crews have started their work to restore power. Now you hear everybody's emergency generators are running up and down the street, so we're all in our emergency backups. Despite several trees down across town, the fire chief says thankfully no one was hurt. In Halifax, Jennifer Egan, WCVB News Center 5.